Welcome to the day in the life of the cutest, yet the most stubborn little bulldog you are ever going to meet. This is Benny, and he's officially one years old. And yes, he's sleeping in our bed. This is not by our choice. It's actually a big rule that he was not going to sleep in our bed. But here we are. This is his bed now. Let me show you his old one that he uh, clearly evicted himself from. He loved it ever since he was a puppy. He had all of his friends that he would hang out in there with at night. And then just one day, he realized that he can go airborne. And he could jump into the bed. And that was it. Game over. This is his new place now. And there's nothing we can do about it. So like I said, the cutest, but also the most stubborn bulldog in the world. And when he's laying here in this bed, he will stay here as long as he wants to. We actually have to physically pick him up and get him out of bed to make him go to the bathroom in the morning. And uh, we're about to do that right now. Hi, Ben. Ready to go outside? Time to wake up. It's been a long night, man. You've been here for hours. Very, very long time. Because the truth is, all this dude wants to do is just cuddle. That's his life. He's just a cuddle monster. And that's the reason why we uh, deal with his stubbornness. It's because <laughs> he's cute. He's a good dog. He really is. And today we're going to show you all the um, very intricate little details of his personality uh, that make him Benny. Uh, it's been a very interesting year with him compared to our English Bulldogs. Um, there's a big difference between the English Bulldogs and the French Bulldogs. <laughs> that was a really long yawn. Uh, the amount of energy that this guy has is the big difference. So, okay, He's just straight back to sleep again. We just got to get him going. And once we get him going, though, that's it. He's on. He's, he's ready to go. What are you doing? Oh, you're trying to bite my finger? That's what you're setting up for? Very, very weird little dog. But, all right, you got to go outside. Let's do this. All right. It's go time. We're officially turning on the machine. And he doesn't stop after this, though. This is it. Second we get him going. Look if he's outside. All right, bud, you ready for this one? Go pee -pees. <laughs> So let's talk about the backyard here. So you can see we have this little fenced up area because where we're staying isn't going to be permanent here and uh, we need to make something that would keep him in here we didn't have to worry and yes i know that's a tiny fence but he he will not jump over that fence <laughs> so um he's got his little area here it's all sanded up because he'll just run around here he'll do his zoomies that's his thing uh it used to be like the rest of the yard that was like all like that but yeah he he carved a little route in there but after he goes to the bathroom in the morning, he'll kind of hang out here with my wife for a while. We usually lay down for a little bit while longer, sit in the sun. Um, he patrols the yard, makes sure there's no lizards around here. That's his biggest uh, pet peeve is the lizards that run around in the backyard. Um, the iguanas, those were an issue, but they haven't been around in a while. I, I, don't, I, I don't know. I saw two yesterday for the first time in almost a month. So this is part of his ritual. He goes to the back door. And he does this itch routine where he just lays here, scratches himself on the mat. He's on sight of point. I'm not just letting him be itchy and uncomfortable. <laughs> yeah, we'll bring that up. I know a lot of people like to put in the comments, oh, he must be itchy, he must have allergies. We've already taken him in. He's, he's actually doing really good. He used to itch himself all the time. Uh, he's on sight of point right now. But this is the only time and he itches. Yeah, that's it. That's it. He doesn't itch himself during the day at all. That's the only little bit right there. So what's next? What are we going to do with Ben next? We're going to feed him. All right. Well, let's bring him inside and get him some food. We'll talk about what he's going to be eating today. Preparing the breakfast. We feed him twice a day. Now, we feed him a uh, interesting little diet. He's got some hard food in there, but he's also got some soft food. And my wife is going to explain exactly what it is. We are transitioning him into raw food. But the lady at the dog store said to start with lightly cooked instead of going full raw. So he's on turkey lightly cooked food with a little with kibble we're doing half and half and then eventually we're going to do all so what's going on with bountiful bone and broth and then some bone broth just to make it a little little gravy okay and then he gets omega-3 half a teaspoon okay and do you like that he loves it looks like he does <laughs> he absolutely loves eating but what's so great about uh benny is he's don't have to worry about him choking or anything like our English Bulldog Leo we had a big time problem with him eating had to worry about him choking like he does everything on his own time 
And uh, yeah, he's actually a really good eater, thankfully. So, all right, I'm not gonna interrupt him while he's eating. We will check back in a little bit. This is absolutely every day. He comes and he jumps onto my leg and stares at me while I eat. Apparently, this is a very popular thing in the French Bulldog community. If you put that fork any closer, he's gonna Look at where the it. fork, anywhere this fork goes, he will follow it. There goes. He's already at the door. Now, the reason why he's at the door is because he's got a new game that he's absolutely obsessed with, and it involves water. He's not doing it yet, though. He's got to digest. He's got to wake up a little bit more, and then we'll go on out there, and we'll show you his new favorite game. But for right now, we're going to let him digest, and we're going to take him for a walk. So now it's time for little Ben to get ready for his walk. They do a couple walks a day, usually, my wife and Benny do. Now they go up the street, and uh, he, he really enjoys himself. He's got his own little routine, and we're going to walk you through it right now. Except for, we're not using that door. <laughs> we're using this door. Ready? Let's do it. This was Starbucks there the other day, now he keeps it. Come in. The smell and everything. not something he sees on his normal yeah, morning so he's, walk. Yeah, so he's very observative right now. Um, there's a chair in the driveway that's usually not there. So he's this guy, he's, he's on it. It's okay. <laughs> what do you think he's doing right now? A poop spot. Is this, is this going to be a poop? Yeah. But he poops on the tree. I didn't know that. Yeah. Oh, there yeah, it is. it's happening. All right, we're going to cut the clip right now. Classic bulldog burnout and cover up <laughs> the poop. Yeah, if we always pick up the poop, that's a, that's a big thing here. If you guys don't pick up the poop, that ain't nice. That ain't cool at all. I was gonna say something worse. <laughs> what were we gonna say? You're going to hell. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it's that bad. Yeah, it is. <laughs> it's contaminated, my dog sniffs it, that my dog true. gets giardia. Yeah, Whatever there's a lot of bad things that can happen from that, so yes. Running? Running? <laughs> they do this every single day. She says running, he grabs a leash, and then they just go running back. It's so weird. The little things that they become obsessed with and become routine to them. So there's nothing better after a nice long walk when it's super high out here in Florida and some water sports. What you're about to see is a bulldog jumping through a glass door in the smallest possible opening to get out here. And we're gonna tell you exactly what he's gonna do. So go ahead, let's open it up. Go, 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 go. <laughs> and it's all because of this right here, the hose. He's obsessed with water. Anything that shoots out water, he's absolutely obsessed with. He just wants to bite it and play with it. So this all started by accident and this is our life now. So might as well get things going. So first things first, we gotta water the plants. This is where wait. this is where he starts building up all the suspense for what's gonna come next. We have some tomatoes and we have some peppers. <laughs> okay. And now we'll go play his game. Alright. We got a lot to talk about here. So this is his favorite game in the world right now. You just shoot the hose into the pool and he chases it around. But we got a lot to talk about with this pool right here. You can see that there's like a extended low end. I think they call it like a beach. And Benny loves this thing. It was hard to get him to learn exactly what it was. Uh, we brought him in the pool and we showed him where it was and everything went really smooth. But then he got super cocky, jumped out of the pool, ran all the way through here and then ran right into the you know, the actual low end, and he just sunk like a rock, and ever since then, he won't go anywhere near there. But he won't go in the pool until we tell him it's okay to go in the pool. <laughs> and when he plays this game, he just stays here in this low end. We do it all the time. We haven't had any errors at all, so we do trust him on this one. But this is what he lives for now. This is his favorite thing in the world. And it all started because we were trying to water the plants that were here, <laughs> and he just got super obsessed with it, and... The rest is history at this point. Benny has a signature towel. Yeah, this is a custom towel he got made. 
It's a long day shooting that picture. No, it's not. Just so happens to be the same exact coloring as this guy. Hey, come on, we gotta get you some water. No drinking in the pool. You know the rules. Get you dried off, get you inside. Come on, let's go. Is there any lizards? He's scanning right now. He's trying to find them. Is there one on the gate? Where? Oh, I see him. Yeah, he's. You can see. I zoom in. You can see right there next to the edge of the wall. He's on the gate. He doesn't see him yet though. But he's scanning. He's putting the work in. They will not. You think he's got him? Okay. Let's open up the door and see what happens. Go get him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the door blocked it, but it's he okay. just scares him. Yeah. Yeah, he doesn't kill him. He just scares him. That's all. He's not a killer. That we know of, at least. I think he would if he could. Yeah. They're just really fast. <laughs> yeah. He's really fast, too, but... Okay, we are back inside, and now it's time to let Benny relax. And like I said, he will keep on going all day. So we're actually going to leave him. We're going to go run some errands and uh, let this guy nap for a little bit. And then we'll come back, and we'll start all over again. So we'll see you in a little bit, bud. Here you go, boy. Guess what? We're back. <laughs> it's lunchtime. And uh, yeah, back to the same exact position again. Uh, he's been sleeping for a few hours, so he's all charged up once again. Um, we're actually gonna be bringing him uh, outside. We're gonna go play a uh, game with him. He loves playing with his ball. That's like his favorite thing. So we're gonna uh, do a couple runs with him, uh, try to tire him out again. Uh, but yeah, he's just, uh, just doing normal Benny stuff. Just wants to be involved in everything that we do. <laughs> so that's what we're gonna do. After I finish eating and Benny watches me eat, uh, we are going to go play with the ball. This is right now. I'm going to show you the fastest little French bulldog on the planet. Ready? Ready? Say, go get it! Oh my goodness, he's so fast. <laughs> oh, he's such a crazy little animal. Come on, bud, bring it over here. Lisa's way better thrower than I am. I'll have her demonstrate. He is so fast. You always have to have a water bowl around when you're playing with a bulldog. It's very, very important. You gotta know his limits because majority of the time they don't know their own. <laughs> he does that like awkward thing where he puts his face against it. So once you finally open up the door, he doesn't come in. He just wants the door open. He wants the option to be there. Oh, this guy is so stubborn. Come on. Say it again. <laughs> Come on! Get in! <laughs> Finally. So right now on the projector in the living room, I just put on the day in the life I did for the English Bulldogs on my YouTube channel. So we're me being on YouTube, watching YouTube of myself. Absolutely ridiculous. But what we're going to show you is Benny really pays attention to what's on TV. I'm going to show you the Bulldogs on there and he's going to freak out. Watch this. <laughs> 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 Only if they were here right now. Hopefully they'd whip you out a little bit. <laughs> I had to turn it off because it was driving him insane. Now what was pretty crazy, the first day that we actually noticed the happening, there was a dog that walked across the screen and he assumed in his head, he was like, I know where that dog's going. So he ran over to that door over there and tried to get in that door because he swore the dog was in there. <laughs> but he's still on patrol right now. He's uh, doing the back end of the house. So Benny's got his dinner all ready to go. We're gonna put this thing down. It's gonna be the same. <laughs> Chill. It's coming, man. Be polite. <laughs> all right, let's put it down. All right, enjoy it, my friend. Uh, it's the same exact uh, thing that he has for breakfast. So nothing different there. Same exact amount. That's how he keeps such a um, athletic figure that he has. <laughs> Pretty good. All right, man. Enjoy. He can be a good boy. Yeah, because he thinks you're about to give him for something. For me. He's just Because I don't give him food. This is what he does for me. Yeah, okay. And that's what he does for Scotty. You see how long he sits there? He jumps on your leg. He won't. Yeah, that didn't take very long. Here we go again. Get down. <laughs> so we actually just left the house. Uh, hence why my wife is so uh, dressed up and ready to go for the day. <laughs> Show what Ben does. <laughs> yeah, but Benny brings us a toy every time we come back. He brings us some kind of toy. He just trots around with it. So proud. 
Um, and his pretty, ears go back. <laughs> it's pretty cute, actually. He's, and he looks like a little Ewok. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> <laughs> So if there's anybody else that has French Bulldogs, if your dog does that too, I'd be very curious to know. So right now we're gonna give Benny a little bit of a treat. This is a popsicle pop right here. So inside there is the popsicle, right? Um, yeah. And it's like, what is it made out of? It's like a hard so rubber. It's like kind of like a hard rubberish plastic. Uh, Benny is so amped up. We're gonna give it to him, let him it's have busy. some fun with it. Uh, I think it's pretty much just gonna be like licking it, chasing it, rolling it. Yeah, and once he gets it, he just licks it. <laughs> But it should keep him busy for a long time. And he deserves it. He's um he's had a pretty awesome day. And hopefully this will wear him out a little bit. What's that? Go ahead, you can enjoy it. He wants to pick it up and bring it to his rug. Not yet. Ooh, yeah. there you go. There you go. <laughs> right to his bed. So we'll let him do that pretty much all the way until he goes to sleep. Because it's getting pretty late. It's about 9.30 right now. And he's usually sleeping at about 10, 10.30. And uh, we'll show you how that ends, but go ahead, bud. Enjoy. We'll leave you alone for a little bit. So we're going to finish up watching Monster Energy Supercross. And we're going to be going to sleep. Benny's already there. On behalf of myself, my wife, and Benny, hope you all enjoyed this video. And we will do another update in the future. <laughs> Good night.